Hello developers, want to build a cross-platform desktop app but not sure which framework to pick? Today we're breaking down Electron, Tari, and Neutralino in a quick comparison to help you decide the right one. Let's dive in. Electron, created by GitHub, lets you build desktop apps using HTML, CSS, and JavaScript powered by Node.js and Chromium. It's behind apps like VS Code and Slack, offering a mature ecosystem and consistent rendering across platforms. But it bundles Chromium, making apps large, think 80 to 120 megabytes, and heavy on memory. Tari, a newer framework, uses Rust for its backend and the OS's native web view like WebKit on macOS or Edge on Windows. This keeps apps tiny, around 2 to 3 megabytes and fast with low memory use. It's secure by default but may need Rust knowledge for advanced features and has a smaller ecosystem. Neutralino is a lightweight alternative also using the OS's web view and written in C++. It's super small, apps are around 0.5 to 2 megabytes and uses JavaScript for both front and back end, making it beginner friendly. However, it lacks Node.js integration and has limited native API support. So, how do they stack up? Here's a breakdown. Electron shines for complex apps with its vast ecosystem, perfect for teams comfortable with JavaScript. Tori is ideal for performance-driven apps where size and speed matter, especially if you're open to learning Rust. Neutralino is great for simple, lightweight apps, especially for JavaScript developers wanting a minimal setup. Choose Electron for rich, feature-heavy apps, Tori for efficient, secure performance, or Neutralino for quick, ultralight projects. Pick based on your needs and team skills. Got questions? Drop them below. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, and happy coding.